Hey, William. How's the progress of the new location coming? Hey, Henry. Everything's going well. The animatronics are on track, and I'm confident about meeting our opening date. That's good to hear. However, I need to emphasize that safety is our top priority. And if we can't afford any mistakes, pressure to meet the deadline might cause you to rush things. I understand your concern, but rest assured that safety is always my top priority. I know what I'm doing, and I won't take any unnecessary risks. I hope so, but I've been hearing some worries from others that your methods of work could lead to some problems. They're also worried that your recent divorce might affect your judgment. My personal life has nothing to do with my work. As for my methods, they have always worked in the past and will work now. I have everything under control. I see. Just remember that I'm here to support you and the company. If you need any help or advice, don't hesitate to ask. Thank you for your offer, but I've got it covered. I'll keep you updated on the progress. Please do. And keep in mind that safety comes first. We don't want any injuries or accidents. Of course, Henry. Talk to you soon. Take care, William. Hello, it's Waffle Brogy here, and welcome to your second night on the job. You seem to have everything under control, don't you? That's what I like to see, someone who can handle themselves. I'll keep it short and only tell you what is absolutely necessary. The main two animatronics also have a second functionality that'll blow your mind. You can actually wear them like a costume. Now, I know what you're thinking. Waffle, that sounds like the greatest thing ever, but... Hold your horses for a second. These newer models aren't quite perfected yet. They've got a bit of a... Well, let's call it a design flaw. You see, if you're not careful, it could crush your chest, and you'll bleed out until the dawn. Trust me, it's not a pretty picture. We had an incident with one of our employees not too long ago. Poor guy ended up in a hospital bed with his legs crushed. It's tragic, but informative. Now, I'm not saying you shouldn't try it out if you're feeling brave, but just know that if something goes wrong, it's on you. Actually, don't even touch them. We're not taking any responsibility here. So if we find you the next morning, dead inside of one of our mascots, don't come crying to us. You were informed, and we are clean. Uh, yeah. True. <laughs> anyway, a new mascot was added to the cast recently. And not just any mascot, mind you. This one's special. Made solely by one of the founders himself, Henry Emily. Now, I don't know much about it, but what I do know is that it's been causing some trouble. So much so that we had to lock it up in your office. But don't worry, we've got a prize corner set up there, and it's a win-win situation for all of us, right? Just make sure you keep an eye on that little bugger and put it back in its place if it tries to wander off. We don't want a repeat of that old tale where a puppet crept into a sleeping man's mouth, do we now? But listen, kid, don't worry... We'll get through this, we always do. Just keep an eye on those animatronics and stay out of trouble. And remember, I'm always here for you. Yeah, gonna go get some shut-eye. Talk to you tomorrow. Goodbye.